We are at Marston Treatment Plant. So today we're out here to inspect a piece of 108 inch diameter pipe that allows us to take water from around the reservoir rather than put water in the reservoir. Wow, that is yeah, tight. Gonna be tight. So one of the things that Denver Water does every time it's possible is to get inside pipe and take a look. And so this is a great opportunity for us to come in, take a look, make sure it's doing what it's supposed to do, make sure there aren't any issues with corrosion, for example, or anything like that. And that helps us ensure not only the stability of the pipe itself, but it helps us with water quality issues, it helps us with knowing if we may have an issue that we need to replace this pipe so we would maybe speed up its replacement or a repair. So in a situation like this piece of pipe in particular, we need to be able to move vast amounts of water um, into the treatment plant for the really hot summer months. So we need to be able to make sure we can pull in as much demand as we need. This allows us to divert water around the reservoir itself and still get water from the South Platte to the treatment plant without having to go into the forebay itself. Now see, I realized there was a turn here. So the reason we have different diameter pipes in the system is very often, not only do we have to supply neighborhoods, but we have to move water long distances across town. And so we use those larger pipes to move large amounts of water far distances. And within neighborhoods, we use the smaller diameter pipes to actually serve customers in the neighborhood. One of the things Denver Water really prides itself on as a utility is we want to make sure that we have backups for all sorts of things that we know we might need at any one point. And so the bypass itself provides us a redundancy that should anything ever happen to the reservoir itself or we have water quality issues in the reservoir, we can still get water to the treatment plant.